How's it going everybody? My name's Eric and in this video I'm going to show you how to print multiple labels for multiple boxes on the same order on eBay. This is a question that I got on Instagram from M-G-O-D-A-E-N-G, -E Mr. Dang. He said, out of curiosity, have you shipped multiple items in different packages to the same location before? Do you know how to print shipping labels for that? I do. I did this last year for my Bowflex Select Tech dumbbells that sold at peak during home gym spike. I shipped them in, I think, three or four boxes, all flat rate boxes from the same order on eBay, and it got the shipping down to an affordable amount. So if you have something that's too big to put in one box and you want to split it up into two boxes, three boxes, four boxes, or whatever it is possible to do, and that's what I'm going to show you in this video. Maybe you have an oversized piece of equipment that you need to break down. Maybe you have some rims like Mr. Dang does. He's actually shipping four heavy rims, so he's going to put one in a box or two of them in a box, but that's what we're going to be going over in this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please give the video a thumbs up. If you aren't already subscribed to the channel, consider subscribing, and let's get into the tutorial. So you're going to want to open the shipping order for that item. You're going to want to plug in your weight and your dimensions for your first box and pick your service. If it's heavy, 25 pounds, your box dimensions, maybe it's 25 by 10 by 13, and you're probably going to want to ship FedEx or UPS. And then once you make sure everything is right, you're going to purchase that first shipping label for that first box. Now, once you do that, after printing that first label, put it on the first box so you don't get any of the boxes mixed up or confused. Hover over my eBay, go to selling, and then you're going to go over here, hover over orders, go down to shipping labels, and then you're going to find that order that you bought that first label for. And you're just going to hit this little drop down and it says print another label. That will bring you back to this page, but it's going to be the second box. And as soon as you type in your dimensions for your second box and your weight, pick your carrier and purchase that shipping label, it's going to add a second tracking number to that order. If you need to print a label for a third box, do the same thing. Drop down, print another label, fill it out, print your label. That adds your third track. And if you need to do a fourth or a fifth box, that's how you do it. So I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you have any questions, throw them in the comments section. It's very rare that I have to do this, maybe like once or twice a year. Just totally depends on what you're selling, but hopefully it was helpful. If you haven't already, please give the video a thumbs up. If you aren't already subscribed to the channel, consider subscribing and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye.